Hey guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy XII. This is Yi Young for this. Uh, last time we got here, well, we infiltrated the palace and got kicked out, met Fran and Anne Balthier. Uh This is our Gambit setup uh, as of right now. Uh, I have Vaughn, if anybody gets really injured, just have him use a potion. Uh, actually, nearest visible for now. That'll work. Attack. Uh, ball fear. That's basically what his does. Uh, first aid is basically cure an enemy that's really heavily injured, like critical state. So he won't be using that until they get into critical. And then Fran, since she has some innate white spells like cure, she has cure. She even has access to fire and all that stuff. So, yeah. Anyway, that's her stuff, and she uses... Right now, uh, she has a bow equipped, and Balthier has a gun equipped. Uh, they'll be switching weapons a little bit later on. And all that stuff, so... Insurgents. Most like they thought to take advantage of a lax watch at the palace while the fate's on. To feed the good consul a length of steel for his supper. I should think Vane used to such hospitality. Clever. He used himself as the bait to draw them near, and then sent in the air brigade. A fine, bloody banquet. Hmm. I dare say I've soiled my cuffs. If a dungeon's waiting for us at the end of the night, it had best have a change of wardrobe. <laughs> I like Balthier. He actually is probably... He is my favorite character in this entire game. Love Balthier. I mean, he technically... I guess he is a main character because he does get tied into the story a little bit later on. Um, okay, here's the map for this place. Like I said, if you just look around, they kind of hold your hand and give you the map right at the very beginning of the dungeon. At least for the first uh, third of the game. So, yeah. Anyway, I... I don't think... where do I need to go? Real quick. Okay, I don't need to go up. I think there's some treasure chests up there, but I think it's just potions and all that stuff. Um, so I'm, This is basically where I'm going to start abusing the fast-forward ability since I have gambits on. And for the first little bit, gambits are actually really helpful and all these things, since we have like three people in our party now. All these guys are just basically going to die in one hit anyway. One round of attacks. So, yeah. This is where stuff gets re... You get... Well, not really powerful, but you... This is the part of the game where I would recommend you just sit there and kill every single monster you come across. And even go out of your way and look for monsters, because... If you do, you'll get a, uh, an overabundance of LP, which will help you out. There's some licenses on the license board, which will give you access to higher amounts of HP. And I would really want to go, at least for myself, get at least one upgrade of HP for everybody in my party before the first boss fight. Uh, well, second boss fight of the game, I guess you could say, because that one in the introduction... I, like I said, is a pseudo boss fight. It wasn't really that much of a boss fight, but yeah, whatever. And since Fran has cure, I can go all out and not even worry about stuff. At least for now. Once the enemies get a little bit stronger, then I'll have to be on my toes and yeah, be able to figure out where I'm going. Howdy, frog! Yeah, these guys, these frogs like to cast HP regen on themselves, but that's... yeah. You don't have to worry about that until later on. Alright, goodbye, rat. Nothing good yet. Yeah, we won't be able to get any good stuff in treasure chests for a while, anyway. Oh, Angel Song, that's the 
move that he uses in order to give him uh, HP regen. Which, if you have a high enough DPS, you're not going to have to worry about it all too much. And if I were using the uh, US version of the game, I would not be going in and going through and defeating all these enemies. <laughs> I just, I would be... Uh, on screen I'd just be going and trying to skip all these fights, but since I have the ability to fast forward through them, oh, it makes it so much easier. Not only that, but I'll be able to get license points a lot, and uh, yeah. So we can actually go and get stuff like HP bonuses and all that fun stuff. Uh, let's see, there's some for Vaughn. Let's see if we have HP bonuses. Yeah, we have one right off the bat for Balthier that we can get. A couple of them for Balthier that we can get. Woo! Yes! Good job, Balthier. Alright, Fran, she won't be getting any HP uh, stuff for the first little bit here. Um, but... I'm trying to figure out... Yeah, I don't, she doesn't even really have anything on her that I really care about right now, so I'll just leave her with all of her LP points for now. For the time being. Just so that when I do get her something, I can plan out ahead. The first half of the game, it, you basically have to plan out your license points and figure out where everything goes on the license board. And then after that, you'll be able... I, if you're good at going through and... Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to save my game real quick. I'll be right back. Alright, so... So what was I doing? Oh yeah, license points. If you're really good at actually going around and fighting every enemy that you come across, you shouldn't be that worse for wear on license points, so... Who would be next? Close ranks, bring her down. Shove down. Hurry. She's not alone. Our ranks grow by the hour. And our troubles with them. Alright, so... Yay, now we get to fight Imperial Beasts. Uh, and we get a guest in our party. Wonder who this girl can, is. She looks kind of familiar to me, but that's about it. However, yeah, this freaking fight is easy. Fast forward through it. You all right? Thank you. Um, I'm Vaughn, and this is Balthier, and... Hey! What's your name? Amalia. Amalia, huh? Nice to meet you. There were others with me. I'm sorry. No. Huh? Oh, now isn't that impressive? Don't get any ideas. I said it's mine. I'm afraid the jury's still out on that one. You stole that? Yeah. Have you finished? When the guards don't report in, they'll come looking for us. If they aren't already. You should come with us. Better than being by yourself. Very well. What's wrong with her? <sighs> You have a lot to learn before we even get started on your thievery. What's that mean? That means be a little discreet on uh, what you steal and when you steal, Vaughn. You don't want to go around and be like, Hey, peoples, I'm a thief! Even... yeah. Yeah. 
The situation requires I accept such help as I find, though it be from thieves. I shall accompany you until we find my companions, no longer. Let's think of her as a guest, then. Unlike Fran or myself, our guest probably won't be taking orders from anyone anytime soon, and she'll leave when she pleases. So we keep to our affairs and she to hers. I doubt we'll find her wanting in valor, being such an upstanding member of the insurgents. Resistance. All right, so we get Amalia in our team. Now... Well, what are we waiting for? Waiting for this cutscene to get over, that's what we're waiting for. All right, so... Another difference between the US version and this version is... We can actually control guests. I mean, Balthier said we can't control guests and they'll leave any time they want. Uh, yes, they'll leave any time they want in the storyline, but we can actually control them. Unlike in the US version, where you can't. And you can actually issue orders to them. And you can actually see what they have available. So, yeah. However, you can't you can't even get into their equipment and uh, do that in their equipment so eh whatever so nice little thing let's see what is the next room double check if it's the room that I'm thinking of then I'm gonna have to switch up Fran yep is this is the room that I'm thinking of alright Fran I'm going to swap out one of your gambits real quick instead of attacking stuff I want you to cast fire only for this battle coming up big huge open room yeah ready for boss time yay we get to fight flans yeah You know, we could have avoided this fight if we ran straight forward and not out here, but even if you run straight forward, the cutscene will still happen with them running out here. So yeah. Anyway, fire is actually an AoE attack in this version, so yeah. Which will help out a lot in this fight. Actually, I don't even think we'll be... Yeah, I'm just going to speed this up, because we're practically almost done anyway. Yeah, like I said, with fire, it goes extremely fast. These guys are weak to magic. So, especially fire. Yay. And now, for a victory pose. I said, time for a victory pose. Hmm. They even get the Final Fantasy theme, or the... The, uh... What you call it? Victory theme in this game. I didn't think that the first time I played this game, I didn't think they would actually be able to fit the victory theme into this game, but hey, whatever. Right after a boss battle? Sweet. I'll go for it. Also, yeah, Vaughn. Not not that. Let's do any. Uh, do 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 eye drops. Since we have people that are blinded in my party. Oh, another another difference between uh, this version and the U.S. version is that uh, the guests in your party, in the international version, actually gain experience along with you and actually level up. Whereas in the U.S. version, they only get into your party at a certain level, and they never ever gain any levels, get any stronger as you go along, which is actually really nice, if you ask me. So. 
like really nice especially later on in the game once you get different guests and all that and if you want to get into a oh wait 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 uh, no I need to get you off of fire friend next uh, boss fight we're coming up to he actually gains health from fire so mm. there you go No, no, I thought there was a treasure chest over there. Apparently not. Oh, these guys are weak to fire. I might as well get get her back. Well, I'll leave her out of fire for the time being. Yeah, since she's going to be using cure most of the time anyway. Because, yeah. As of right now, I'm, she's going to be my primary healer. Do I have any good licenses to get more HP? E yeah, not really. All right, cool. Just checking, because boss fights actually give you really decent eight uh, license points. So, yeah. All right. Let's see if I can continue on. I don't think I'll be able to fit the next boss fight into this. Part, seeing as we're coming up to time, or well, we have three minutes. We're not actually coming up to time yet. So, but I don't think I'll get the boss battle and the un and then the cutscenes that are coming up within the next little bit. So, all right, come on. Quit blinding me. Yeah, Amalia has cure too, so that's actually quite... Wow, that's way too many freaking people on the freaking screen at one time. We need to get some people gone. Alright, I think we're... We're getting good. That could have been bad. That could have been a bad fight, but... Alright, everybody in one piece? Alright, that's the staircase back down if it... Treasure chest? You weren't there before. Good lord, you... Really? Huh. What is over here? I... There's a lot of crap in here that I don't know. Alright, where am I going? Oh, that's where I need to go. Alright. Yeah, that's that's definitely where I need to go. Okay, I'll go this way then. Wait, what? Uh, it's been a while since I've explored the sewers. Good lord, buddy. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to fit this boss battle into this part. So, again, I shall bid you all adieu for now. I'll go ahead and do the next boss fight in the next part. This is you, Tung, for this signing off, saying keep things frosty.